What is up you guys, it is Semisa45 here and in this video I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the Android L look and features on your Android device. Now I do want to give you guys two quick notes before this. One, yes I am very aware that there are many tutorials on YouTube already showing you how to get these features on your Android L device. I'm just doing this because I'm here to reply to a comment on one of my videos which was the how to use theme chooser themes on the stock ROM on Android if you want to see that video I left a link to it in the video description below where you can check it out but anyways I'm just replying to a comment on that video so yeah that's why I made this video and two this tutorial will not give you one the notification center of Android L, which is basically this status bar here at the top and this will also not give you the keyboard of Android L, but if you are interested in getting it and you're rooted, go ahead and check the this go ahead and check the link in the video description below where I left a link to a tutorial that I found on the internet where you can get the the Android L keyboard on your Android device if you're rooted and this will also not give you the full lock screen of Android L and this will also not give you the full Android L navigation buttons of Android L but if you are interested of getting the navigation buttons of Android L I left a link in the video description below to a tutorial video I did on how to get that on your rooted Android device so make sure you're rooted before you do it and if any of these become available to any non-rooted user, I'll be sure to let you guys know in the comment section below. So be sure to check there regularly for whenever I update you guys if these features will ever become available to non-rooted users. But as of the end of this video, they are not available for any, any non-rooted user. Okay, so to start off, we're going to start off with the launcher of Android L. Now if you want to get the launcher of Android L, you will first need to download from the Google Play Store Nova Launcher. So to do that, just go ahead and go into the Google Play Store. Wait for it to load up. Then tap the search icon at the top right. And then type in Nova Launcher. Type it in just like that. And wait for it to load up. Go ahead and tap it. It's made by Tesla Coil Software as of the date of this video. Go ahead and download it. Tap accept. Wait for it to download. Then wait for it to finish installing. Then once it finishes installing, tap open and wait for it to open up. Then once it opens up, you'll get a empty lock. You'll get an empty home screen full of nothing. You can either import your backup of Nova Launcher from before if you've used it before, or you can import it from another launcher choose whatever you want to set up the whole host the whole home screen then once you're finished go ahead and press and hold on the app tray icon at the bottom then tap edit then tap the icon at the left then wait for it to load up it does take a while so just be patient wait for it to load up Then once you get to this screen, make sure you're under built in. Then tap the white icon under the section default. Then tap the check icon at the top. And then the app drawer should change. Then press and hold on any empty home screen. On any empty space on any home screen. Then tap the settings icon at the top right. Then go to where it says desktop. Then tap persistent search bar 
and then make sure you select L preview. And then go back, then tap where it says folders, then tap folder preview and make sure it's line. Make sure you select line, then tap back, tap back again, then tap look and feel. And uh, from there, yeah, make sure everything is just like this. And then from there, you've already set up your whole launcher. Now, if you want to get the wallpaper of Android L, you'll need to download an app from the Google Play Store called Android L Wallpaper. So go into the Google Play Store, tap the search icon at the top right, and then type in Android L Wallpaper. Wait for it to load up. Then tap the first one at the top. It should be me, my Donatus. I'm probably saying that wrong. We'll go ahead and tap download, but go ahead and tap install, then tap accept, then wait for the app to download and install on your Android device. Then once it finishes installing, tap open. Then tap where it says Android L wallpaper. Then tap the first one at the top which is colored blue, then tap back, then tap set wallpaper, and then you should have the new Android L wallpaper. Then if you want to get the icon pack of Android L, go ahead and download an icon pack from the Google Play Store called Moonshine. So go ahead and open the Google Play Store, tap the search icon at the top right, and then type in Moonshine. That's one word. It should pop up here. Looks like it hasn't, so go ahead and tap search. And then go ahead and tap the first one, which is titled Moonshine Icon Pad. As of the date of this video, it's made by Nextbit Design. So go ahead and tap install, wait for it to download and in then tap accept, then wait for the icon pack to download and install on your Android device. Then once it finishes installing, go ahead and tap open. Then tap apply theme. Then tap Nova and then it should ask you for, it should, you should get a prompt that looks like this. Tap OK, then wait for the icon pack to pop up on your Android device but if for some reason it does not pop up go ahead and press and hold on any empty space on any home screen then tap the settings icon at the top right then tap look and feel then tap icon theme and make sure you select moonshine then go ahead and exit out of this then the icon pack should change and you should get the icon pack of Android L then uh from there guys that's it that's how to get the android l looking features on your android device now like i said this will not give you the notification center of android l this will not give you the navigation buttons of android l and this will not give you the the keyboard of android l but if you are interested of getting the navigation buttons and the keyboard of android l check the links in the video description below where i left links to those and uh, the, as of the date of this video, there's no way to get the notification center of Android L or the lock screen of Android L. But like I said, if it does become available to any non-rooted user, I'll be sure to update you guys in the comment section below. So be sure to check there regularly. But either way, guys, that's it. That's how to get the Android L looking features on your Android device. Now, if you guys like this video, feel free to give it a thumbs up because that will definitely help me out. And if you have any suggestions on what I should do next, or if you have any problems with this tutorial whatsoever, feel free to let me know in the comment section below. And while you're at it, feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel because I got tons of more content coming your way. I release a new video every Saturday and Sunday. And thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys will like me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter, follow me on Instagram. I left all those links in the video description below. Once again, thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys in the next video.
this is the Mysa45 signing off.